but it's just a quick, it's just the same thing. I mean, we do everything exactly the same. There's nothing different, but, so you guys understand that exactly what I did before. We find, you know, our radical two, which one, where is our y gonna be in negative? And we notice that there's pretty much two points, right? Um, we know that our original point, which is at 45 degrees, or let's just do it in radians, five or four, is gonna be radical two over two, comma, radical two over two. But that is when your y is positive, right? So to find our two negatives, it's going to be at a negative pi over four, which is um, two radical two over two, comma, negative radical two over two. And you could say this one would be a you know positive three pi over two. Or one pi, two pi, three pi. One pi. 2 pi, 3 pi, 4 pi, 5 pi. 6 pi, so okay. Um, and that one's going to be negative radical 2 over 2, comma, negative radical 2 over 2. However, what we talked about, though, uh, was remember that our constraints had to be between negative pi over 2 and pi over 2, right? Right? So therefore, obviously, this angle does not work. Now, the one thing I want to make sure I'm clarifying with you is... Be careful when you're drawing your angles. We're going to have to use the negative angle because it ha that's the only one that's going to be within our constraints. We can't go over and around to there because now it's going to be getting out. It's going to be larger than our constraints. Because if you guys remember, right? If you remember what the inverse sine graph looks like, and it's supposed to cross up here. But if you remember what the inverse sine graph looks like, right? That's only going to be between negative pi over two and pi over two. So we can't do an angle that's gonna be larger than that because then it's gonna continue on your graph which will not make it a function with the vertical line test. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. That just explained? It's only between negative pi over two and pi over two. We can't go around and give a positive angle that's larger than that. Make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I wanna make sure I clarified with that.